Hey, you don't look like you belong on a beach. Who are you? What are you doing here? My name's Sandy. I'm a semiconductor chip. I actually started out as a grain of sand and have traveled all around the world to become a professional semiconductor chip. I'm a semiconductor in your infrastructure. It's hip to be a chip. It's hip. It's hip to be a chip. Well, it's nice to meet you, Sandy. My name's David. So, how did you go from sand to a semiconductor chip? It's a long process, but it's really neat. Come on, I'll show you. Let's make a chip. There's no step we will skip. Yeah, so much goes into making a chip. Every semiconductor chip starts as sand until we are compressed with carbon and heat to become silicon. Then compressed silicon is cut into thin circles called wafers by a powerful circular saw and polished by a machine. That's pretty neat, Sandy, but when do the wafers become chips, and who decides where the chips will live when they're completed? Well, David, that all happens in this room here, where design engineers draw up 3D plans for the architecture of the integrated circuit layers. It's kind of like giving each chip a profession. Not yet a chip, there is more to our trip, but we are so close to having a chip. Time to suit up. Huh? We are headed to the clean room. Where? What happens? One particle of dust could ruin the whole process, so we have to be extra careful. It's cleaner than an operating room. Let's make a chip. There's no step we will skip. Yeah, so much goes into making a chip. Say cheese. Whoa, what was that? I can't see. <laughs> Don't worry. It's kind of just like the process of plasma etching the chips are going through right now. A light sensitive layer is transferring the design onto the wafer. Let's make a chip. There's no step we will skip. Yeah, so much goes into making a chip. Yikes. What is that saw doing? It's separating the chips down the scribe line. They're kind of like my twin brothers and sisters and are all going to work in different places. Some will go to electric cars and trains. Others will go to washing machines and cell phones. Wow, is that a finished semiconductor chip? You bet it is. Now the chips are in the final stage called fabrication and are ready to be shipped out around the world. We've just seen how some of the world's highest performing processors are created. Let's catch a ride back to the beach. We made a chip, now we're done with our trip. Yeah, so much goes into making a chip. So you see, from microchip to powering an autonomous ship, we're making the world better together. We sure are. Gee, thanks, Sandy. It's hip, hip to be a chip. It's hip to be a chip. <laughs> <laughs>